Hi there, I'm Logan Medish, and this is High Caliber History. Today, I'm at Fort Ligonier in Pennsylvania, and I'm holding one of the most remarkable pistols uh, that has ever existed in American history. Made in Saarbrück, France, which is now part of Germany by Jacob Walster, this pair of pistols was purchased by the Marquis de Lafayette, who gave them to one of his best lifelong friends, George Washington. Washington carried the pistols, and it's believed that he had them with him at Valley Forge, Monmouth, uh, and the Battle of Yorktown, and then later while he was president during the Whiskey Rebellion. The pistols are an exceptionally well-made pair, uh, beautifully crafted. There is wonderful engraving and filigree all up down the barrels and on the side plates, wonderful wood carving on the stocks, and just a fantastic example of the type of craftsmanship that was made in the, the last quarter of the 18th century. And these pistols, not only are they remarkable for their connection to George Washington and the Marquis de Lafayette, but they have an even more remarkable connection to another American president. After George Washington passed away, his nephew received the pistols and they went down the line until they ended up being given to President Andrew Jackson. And that's where it also ties back into the Marquis de Lafayette. When he came over in 1824 and 1825 to do his tour of the United States, he stopped at the Hermitage in Tennessee and visited with Andrew Jackson, who pulled out these pistols and showed them to the Marquis and asked him if he recognized them. The Marquis did and said, I remember giving these to my good friend, General Washington. And so these pistols, have an incredible storied history. They've been passed down to some of the most uh, top names in both American and world history, and they hold a remarkable place here in Fort Ligonier because it helps tie together the connection between the French and the Americans. George Washington is fighting the French during the French and Indian War, and then just a couple decades later, we would not have succeeded in gaining our independence had it not been for the help of the French and the Marquis de Lafayette. So it all comes full circle with this remarkable pair of pistols on display at Fort Ligonier. Come tour the fort, uh, check out all the exhibits here, and definitely make sure you stop by and look at these pistols and take a, a good, long, hard look at them. The case that they're in is remarkable. You can get all the way around and see both sides of these guns. Uh, definitely not something you would want to miss. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.